abortion. You hear the news? Skullgirl's been going after all those families in Maplecrest. Looks like this new Skullgirl's got a bone to pick with the boss. Where's he gone anyway, huh? Think the rumors of him getting sick are true? Hold up. Look, there she is. That fishfolk dame we were sent to find. Hey, Goily. Can we get some uh, service over here? Yes. May I help you, sir? Hey, now. You're quite the dish. I'd like to eat you up. <laughs> Why don't you swim over here with a couple free drinks? I, I'm sorry, but I need to work. You know, you are pretty cute. Look, stinky kill girl. Is everything okay over here? Are these guys bugging you, Manette? Go find yourself a sandbox, kitty. We're just having a friendly chat with the little minnow here. Leave. Now, or I'll throw you out myself. Can't you take a clue, you flea-bitten tot? Clearly you don't know who you're messing with. <laughs> Did you see that? That stupid cat didn't stand a chance. I think it's time I make my move and follow them. I've got to catch me a skull girl. And it sounds like Mafia Goons are the perfect bait to draw her out. Sounds very dangerous! Be careful out there. You're like family to us, you know? Nadia, do you really think the skull heart can bring your friends back? There's only one way to find out. See you around, Union. And give my regards to your dad, Manette. Well, well, what have we here? 
That's quite the body you've got there, Kitty. <laughs> Sorry, creepy lady. I'm not interested. Oh, don't get the wrong idea. I was just admiring your scars. You've been cut clean through several times over. No one could survive that. Yet here you are, walking, talking, and shedding. Whatever's animating you could be invaluable to my research. Let's perform an autopsy and see what makes you tick. I think you're looking for a lab rat. Ready? Down the hatch! Use high! It's been through worse. <laughs> you, but I've seen all that I need to see. And I'm sure the analysis of this blood will prove most enlightening. You just don't stop, do you? Lady Valentine, the Skull Girl has requested your presence on the building control. A nurse and a nun. Huh, where have I heard this joke before? I'll be there soon, Double. Return and let Marie know that I found Lorenzo. His minions led me right to him. I just had to stop and perform a little experiment on our feline friend here. Very well. Take care, Kitty. We'll have a follow-up visit as soon as these tests come back from the lab. So, the school girl is hiding out at the Grand Cathedral, is she? Never was one for churches, but here I'll make an exception. We'll be back together soon enough, guys. Let's put an end to this cat and mouse game. Ladies and gentlemen, it's showtime! <laughs> So, this is the Grand Cathedral, eh? Now, what's a schoolgirl like you doing in a place like this? She followed me home, Double. Can I keep her? You again! Don't you have an appointment with the schoolgirl? Indeed, I did. But I'm afraid we've got a scheduling conflict. As it turns out, you've got an appointment on my dissection table, right about now. Let's not be late, or I'll have to get my spray bottle. You couldn't beat me before, so what makes you think you can now? Yes, my previous experiment was a failure, but I've got my lab assistant to help this time around. May the Trinity have mercy on this poor, lost soul. The nun is your lab assistant? I hate to break it to you, lady, but you're not going to get much science out of this one. Your experience will have to wait, Valentine. She is a candidate. A candidate, you say? Even better. Come on, Kitty. The doctor will see you now. I think you're looking for a lab rat. 
Ladies and gentlemen, it's... All right, Skullgirl, you know why I'm here. I do. So, no offense, but you're the last thing standing between me and my family. So let's get this show on the road. I too have lost much to the Medicis. Do you not seek vengeance? Wishes such as yours rarely turn out well. I've got to try. The Fishbone Gang raised me, protected me, and taught me everything I know. The least I can do is return the favor. Your instincts are admirable. My wish was also to protect my friends. Look, I'm gonna have to stop you before you get to the we're a lot alike, you and I bit. I've come too far to turn around, so it's time to claw that heart out of you. So be it. I hope your wish turns out well. This is it. I... I can't do it. I have so many new friends in Little Innsmouth. Terrible as it was, what happened happened and made me who I am today. Changing that would be wrong. That's what the skull heart is here for, isn't it? To tempt us into doing the wrong thing. Marie said her wish was similar, and look how she turned out. This stops here! A temporary setback. 
This world will always be cursed by a skull heart. And so shall it always be cursed with skull girls. Until this world exists no more. Hmm. All that for a life lesson? How annoying. Well, better go check in on everyone back in Little Innsmouth. Get some food. I'm exhausted. Union! I'm back! I'm starving! It's time for that free meal you promised! Bring me the full Lucky Family Banquet! Nadia! There you are! Minette has been kidnapped! All the River King's daughters! And others, too! Little Innsmouth is in a panic! What? Who would dare do such a thing? That's where I come in. My name is Irvin. I'm a private detective. The River King hired me to find his daughters, so if you have any information that might help, I'd appreciate if you shared it. The proprietor of this fine establishment was telling me that there have been numerous Mafia sightings in the area recently. That's the only lead we've got but kidnapping certainly fits the mob's M.O. We're at a loss as to why they'd be targeting Dagonian women, though. The Mafia! Maybe Marie had it right all along. Urban, I'm coming with you. Those black-hearted bastards already took one family from me, and like hell I'm going to let them do it again. Hang in there, Minette. We'll find you. <laughs>